Hey guys, today I want to show you an overlay that was specifically designed to help you plan your races better, especially in practice sessions. This is the race schedule overlay, and it does exactly what the name suggests. It shows you a live table of upcoming iRacing races. So let's just see what this overlay can do. If I click on the overlay, we will see all the settings on the right side. Now, this is only one item. I mentioned the table. This becomes a table when you add multiple series manually. By default, this will only show you the current session. So if you go to a GT4 challenge series session, which is a practice session, and open this overlay, then you will see the same series and its registration time. So it's always matching with the series you are practicing within. That's why it's very useful. You don't have to set up anything. Anywhere you go, you will see the current series start time. But if you want to have more, because you want to monitor more races and when they start, you can, add, you can also do that. Just go to the settings and in the odd series option, there is a drop down here that contains all the iRacing series and you can, you can search them by typing the name of the series. So for example, we search for IMSA iRacing series. Let's say we search for a let's do a Ferrari GT3. Don't be confused that you see the same name and data repeated. This is just some dummy data in a preview to show you how big the overlay will be and how it will look approximately. You will see the actual data when you open the overlay. So let's just do that. You need to be in a session, remember, in a practice session or quality or race. Usually, I imagine you will use this in a practice session. So let's just open the overlay. I'm in a practice session. And as you can see, we are currently in a Formula 4 session. It's showing when this Formula session starts. The registration ends in 4 minutes and 43 seconds. But you can also see all the other series that we just added, uh, the Ferrari and the IMSA series. When the registration is coming close to an end, it will make sure you don't miss the countdown and it will highlight this registration end column in red, making it very obvious that you have to register right now or you're gonna miss it. You can also make this overlay very minimal if you don't want to have a blown up overlay like this. Let me just close this one. And I quickly show you what you can do. So naturally, if you want a minimalistic look of this, you don't want additional series. And then you also just want a very minimal information such as this. So you have removed all the columns. And then I also reduce the size of the overlay. And this could be a very nice overlay somewhere on your screen that has a minimal information, but yet making sure that you don't miss any race. That's it, guys. Play around with the settings and configure the overlay to your liking. Thank you very much for watching the video and see you next time.